Greetings and salutations, and welcome back to another Let's Play of EU4 with Red Bastard as Byzantium. This is a viewer request run, where one of our viewers and subscribers, meaning a random guy from Greece, had requested this run. So, we're doing it. And we fulfilled the requirements for Basileus, and we'd like to accomplish more in Europe. Possibly get Marinostrum as well. But at this point, I'm skeptical about how far we can take it. We can accomplish a lot late in the game, but we didn't even take administrative ideas, so um, I don't know if blobbing is really something we can accomplish with a great deal of certainty. I mean, it might happen. I'm going to try for it. I'm certainly more confident taking on all of our enemies at once now that we've had to do pretty much that. We didn't have to fight the Commonwealth, but we fought Britain, Aragon, Russia at the same time with no support, no meaningful support from allies other than Persia. But Persia's only the seventh ranking great power. We'd need like the second and fifth. Wow, Russia was knocked down. Lost some development. It's also due to institutions. Okay, so what we want out of Hey Jaws is just Mecca. We won't be able to get that. No, sorry. Can't do that. Until we've taken these provinces from Ethiopia. Sorry, not gonna happen. And this is a small fort, so we'll just head down there. Let's capture this and this. Would you? Yeah, we can't take it. Sorry, we'd love to piece you out, but that's not going to happen right now. Okay, that's what we want. We want 10 war score. Uh, we don't have 10 war score, though, so we need to capture some more stuff. I didn't know if we could get down to their capital, so I went for a Holy War CB, and they have denied us battles so far. Let's go over here to capture that. Sorry, Egypt. We are not issuing any peace at this time. Hey, okay, who's that? Pasai. I have to admire your dedication to the war effort. If I was Pasai, I would not be sailing all the way around Africa. All the way through the Indian Ocean, all the way through Africa, around Africa, all the way th through the Mediterranean to land in Austria. That's some serious dedication. Okay, once we capture their capital, I think they'll be willing to discuss peace terms. With Britain is over. We could attack them when we have the troops free. Okay, I'm on. I don't want to be fighting you. How old is Norway? Yeah, that's not going to help us. We don't need Norway. Okay, let's see how this goes. Um, they have mountains. Thank you for the war score. Oh, by the way, we'll be taking that fort. Not in the peace deal, I just mean all Brandenburg. This mean we'll be capturing it. 
Okay. Now we do have our 10 war score. Russia does not consider us to be a rival. And they have a 15 year old ruler on the throne. Now they're just hostile. Okay. Nope. Okay, Oman. We do. Oh, we can take your money. Do you have anything Persian? Well, then you're in luck. We will leave you alone, Oman. Okay, Ethiopia. Let's make this easy. We just want a little bit of stuff from you. And then your money. Oh, you've got 800 ducats, so let's capture capital and take all your cash. We're out of manpower. Oh, we do have large loan sizes. Shouldn't have done that. I should have saved those points for coring. Or manpower pool. Don't worry, we'll deal with your rebels for you. Not intentionally, we were just locked in. But we will have to charge you for that service, so... There we go. That's a pretty reasonable understanding that we've come to. We recently converted all that, apparently. So that does convince me that we just need to raise the autonomy. If we can't convert it, we can't keep it loyal. Get these guys back up here. And now we can try taking this. They would agree. And it doesn't really even upset people. Okay, do you have anything? No. So I don't know if people are making off with Persian cores ever. Congress of Mecca happened to us. And we can get this idea. Okay, we can pay off a bank loan. December, we can take out some money from our burgers. Put down here. And let's see how much room we have in our country. We could take 74 worth of stuff. And that's quite a bit. Oh, that would be pushing it? Well, I think we're going to take it all the same. No, we could get some more war score. Who's still in this war? Pasai. Pasai is the one that's really dragging down our war score. Yemen, we can't get to them easily. Let's get this land. How dare you? 
Yeah, we don't want to upset our allies right now. Greenmouth, spying, Corsair. Now let's take a look at what we can take from them. Yeah, so they're now comfortable with giving us more. We can take 57, so let's, yeah, let's do that. We leave them in bite-sized pieces. They'll be in pretty bad economic shape after this. But if we can capture this, we can probably take a little bit of money from them next month. How much money do you even have? It's not worth it to hold out for too much more. Just get the 100 ducats. And the reason why I say that is we can stop paying our troops so much. Stop paying them really at all, I think. And we can drop down maintenance at this fort. Okay. One second. Let's do a time check, 12 minutes. Okay, we're gonna carry on. We do need 1,600 more ducats. We'll get 400 of it right there. And we could pay back the Swedes. We're not going to, of course because we have exactly zero repercussions if we fail to pay them back. Uh, they're not as happy with us as they used to be, so let's go ahead and improve relations. See if there's anyone else we could take on. And we could feed this stuff back. But that puts us at war with the Emperor and all of their allies. And maybe we should do that. to think of it because that would be a nice way to get around all of these allies but i think we're just going to attack them yeah let's attack the papacy as soon as we have a little bit of manpower Commonwealth, Aragon, Netherlands. Yeah, if we were to attack you, how would people feel about that? Portugal, Brandenburg, France. Uh, Castile is defender of the Catholic faith, though, so they would join in unless something else is going on preventing them from doing that. Okay, I think we'll move troops up here. And there. Pull these guys up and these guys over. Try, try to drop them off in southern Italy. Yeah, for bank loan.
You can never have too much manpower. True that. Okay, I don't want to deal with any rebellions down here since we are pulling our troops out. We're just going to increase the autonomy. Whoops, shouldn't have done that one. And it might be a smarter idea to leave one army down here. So maybe we should leave these guys down here. But we'll just pick them up and drop them back off if we really need to do that. Okay, France, where's your army? Why is... It's all in Colombia. Okay, maybe we should wait until they bring their forces home. And we have most of the coast of Europe now. We do need to get the Papacy and then Iberia. Um, What's the coast of of the Mediterranean, rather? Not Europe. Mecca. Oh. Royal marriage there, sure. Anna Maria is a good. That's Alyssa. We are one over. Why is that? Because we forgot to cancel our military access through Switzerland. How many diplo points did we waste on that? Who knows? Probably a lot. Let's d just double check all of our relations here. Um, Alliance with France, but they don't like us very much. Let's take a look at what's going on here. One second. Okay. Just keep getting notifications. Okay, Royal Marriage Alliance, Royal Marriage Alliance. Yeah, we should be good through everyone. We haven't asked Portugal for permission to move through their country. Let's do that just in case we need it for some reason. We really should top off relations there as well. Okay, you're suffering attrition. Let's get you split up. Okay. Who's going to be our target? 
if we attack the Netherlands, Brandenburg would defend them, so it's Great Britain. If we attack here, Castile would defend them. And that's unfortunate, because that is... The only reason why I wouldn't want to do that. Tell them to prepare for war. See if that helps. I'm aware that France is still carting back troops. So we're going to be cautious. Um, yeah, Egyptians are going to rise up. That's going to happen. No getting on that one. Okay, when can we invade you, Aragon? I think we can. Okay, Castile would not come in on that side. So we could just go for an imperialism CB. Bring in Portugal, bring in Brandenburg, bring in France, but France doesn't have enough troops back here. So let's give it a few months. So let's deal with these uprisings. Sorry, Russia, this matters beyond our control. Okay, the people are pleased. I like it. Decline of the clergy. Okay, the burghers want Macedonia. They'll develop it. Wow, it's 38 development. Okay, you can have it. We will pull it from you. So just know that that's going to happen. Wow. Why would you do that? Why? Okay, hey, Jazzy. Yeah, we need to deal with this as well before we leave. Okay, let's get this guy. He's the cheapest of the options. I do like theologians quite a bit. Is that just to Sweden? Yeah, we're not going to pay them back if we're considering the possibility that we're just going to be fighting them. Okay, that's a little bit of attrition. So we'll split up. Wow, France is really generous with the cash at the moment. Let's go ahead and improve relations here and there. Okay.
Okay, the burgers gain 10 loyalty, sure. See how long this has been going on? 25 minutes. I think we'll do a short video this time. And while we figure out how exactly we're going to handle this, so we can calm down with the papacy, I think we'll attack them and just try to wipe them out right away. and focus all attention on them. Once all the troops are dead, just try to get down some of those sieges. And then hopefully by then, Commonwealth will be a little bit weakened by our allies and subjects. Now France has moved more of their troops back over, so that's a much better situation. Um, we should get some of these guys down here, though. So the best way to make that happen is, of course, just to ask them nicely. Okay, we can ask Portugal for some sort of assistance. Um, hmm. Depo points, I guess. Thank you. Portugal. Okay. Ah, oh, Castile would defend them. And of course, we need to cancel that military access. Damn you, Castile. Why? Why? Okay, what if we attacked here? Okay, we could get France in on the war if we offered them territory, but we could get Brandenburg. Wait, Castile wouldn't join? Ah, oh, you fools. They like them. Why do you like them? Okay, who are we going to attack then? How about you? You like us. Ex Lombard and Lubeck. What if we attack them? Steel would help them. Wow, you're kind of a bastard, Castile. Okay, we'll figure this out later. Thank you for watching. This has been another Let's Play of EU4 with Red Bastard as Byzantium. If you like this, please consider liking the video and or subscribing to my channel.